screen for colorectal cancer has always been defined by the gold standard, which is a screening colonoscopy. Uh, previous recommendations were to obtain one at 50 years old, uh, unless you had some type of family history of colorectal cancer or polyps or some type of symptoms, which could be bleeding, abdominal pain, change in weights, change in bowel habits. More recently, uh, many of the societies that make recommendations for colorectal screening, including the American Cancer Society and American Society of Colorectal Surgery, have actually moved the age up to 45. This happened because we're seeing patients uh, who are younger and younger being diagnosed with colorectal cancer. While screening colonoscopy does remain the gold standard for colorectal cancer screening, there are some other tests that are available. Some of the older tests are fecal occult blood testing, flexible sigmoidoscopy, and barium enema. Uh, these are used in certain circumstances still, uh, but a new test that has come about uh, for colorectal screening is called the ColoGuard test. Now this is a test where you at home um, have a prepackaged um, test uh, packet and you send a sample, sample of your stool uh, to the testing site. They're looking for uh, blood in the stool and also DNA that we know is associated with colon cancer to try to detect that. Um, the benefits of ColoGuard is that you can do it at home. It doesn't require you to do a bowel cleansing or bowel preparation that a colonoscopy does. Um, and it can help detect colorectal cancer with up to 92% uh, sensitivity, meaning if you have colorectal cancer already, it's about 92% effective for detecting that. It can also help detect polyps uh, or precancerous lesions, but the rates are not that as effective as colonoscopy. Uh, the drawbacks are is that, like I said, um, it doesn't detect all colorectal cancers. Uh, another thing is that it has to be done every three years as opposed to a colonoscopy, which can be done up to every 10 years depending on what's going on. Uh, you do have to do some uh, stool collection at home, although the kit does that make that very easy. I would say that ColoGuard uh, is not the gold standard, but if you're worried about undergoing screening with colonoscopy, definitely ColoGuard is something you should discuss with your um, primary care physician, gastroenterologist, or colorectal surgeon, as I like to say that uh, something is better than nothing. However, if you do have a positive ColoGuard test, um, it is important to know that the next step should be a colonoscopy. So everyone should know this going into it, that you don't just get the test uh, and then that's it.